add-on called soft mode. I will show you quickly how I would use it. So you select the monkey, press the create button, and then you can click and drag, for example, click and drag in the eye, click again, and to make a widget. And then we can scale or grab on the Y axis, etc. What happens in the background is that it will make an armature modifier. So it is actually a, an armature. Uh, we can mirror this, activate symmetry. And when we do this, that works well, but sometimes you need to click mirror weight in case, for example, I can do something with the weight. For example, I click this monkey, weight paint, I go to paint opposite group, then I can smooth the weight. because I want to have the whole eye, let's say. Then if I go back object mode and I grab this, then you see the weight doesn't match, but then we can um, mirror weight. If we do that, then it will be mirrored. The idea of this add-on is to make shape keys. Um, but later I will show you that I prefer to use the NLA editor. So let's say you do this. Maybe you want to scale shift Y, I think. No. Uh, scale on the Y axis now. Then there is an option here, select selected to shape keys. Then uh, we are going to hide this uh, effect of the widget. So we can do that. Select the monkey. We go over here to the object data properties. If we scroll down, we see Suzanne. And if we do this, so the idea is then that we can press I, go in the timeline, then make another keyframe, press I here on this, and then change the value, press I here again, and then we have an animation like that. Um, so that's pretty much it. Uh, I couldn't get this to work. Capture shape key. Then I get an error. So, um, we can parent the widgets. So if we move the monkey, the widgets will be parented to the monkey. I didn't get good results with that. So, oh yeah, it seems to work now for some reason. Uh, which size just for the display. Then we had all that. Then I show you what I would do. So file recent. So select the monkey, create and that one. Now instead of using shape keys. I just can animate right away. So scale the widget, press I, scale the widget, press I, let's uh, activate symmetrize. I think that's okay. Now, uh, if we go to the NLA editor, that is editor type animation, this one. Then we see here we can, that arrow, wait. So that means 
push down action. So you see here the keyframes, but if we do this, it will disappear here, but it is now in the store, the animation is stored in this uh, part, and we can shift D and copy it or do more things. I'm not so very familiar with the NLA editor, but you see, it's a little bit easier than um, working with uh, shape keys, I think. All right. 